All right, so you're frustrated. You've got big solar panels. You've got small solar panels. You've got stiff solar panels. And the frustration is you just don't know how to angle them right to get the perfect amount of sun into those panels to recharge your devices or power your devices. Well, guess what? I have an accessory. It was actually made for flat panels like this one and this one, okay? And it actually allows you to angle the panel to the optimum setting. And I'm going to show you this. And guess what? I am going to also show you a trick on how you could make it work with a thick panel like this, which a lot of people have, right? These are like 100 bucks, 75 bucks. So people have these panels. Well, let me show you this accessory that you can buy that's probably around 20 bucks at this time. And I've used it and I like it. It actually works. So let's get started. Hi, it's Al from Tech Made Easy with a real quick message. I just want to let you know the video you're about to watch is not sponsored. We went out and bought the products ourselves. So if you like our video, please give us a thumbs up. It definitely helps. Share our video. And lastly, we hope you subscribe to our channel and become a part of the family. Thank you. So here is the magical accessory. And this is made by EcoFlow and it sells for 20 bucks. But you see that dot? Your goal is to get that dot into the center. And the shadow of that dot in the center. And it'll tell you that the angle that you have is the best angle you can have. So pretty cool, simple, inexpensive. Obviously, as you can see on the side, it is made to be slid onto these thin panels. We're going to show you a little later on how we've used it with bigger panels. Now you can see we're getting uh, 87 watts, 81 watts out of a 160 watt panel. And we've got it angled, as you can see here, this way, right? But, but how can we angle that better to get more sun? Well, let's play with this while the sun is out. And we're dealing with clouds, by the way. So you're going to see a fluctuation of, uh, you know, wattage just be aware but we're looking for how much could we really get so we take this accessory here and all we do with this accessory is we just put it on top end and we're going to put it in the middle now there's no instructional videos on this i've seen it mostly shown in the corners i believe dead center is probably the way to go now i want you to see the shadow see the shadow is on the bottom you want to have that shadow be in the center so what we want to do now is we want to take this panel, we want to lay it back. All right, that's probably going to be the best angle that we're going to get. All right, that's my sweat. <laughs> and so let's give it a moment. Take a look at this. We're getting 123 watts, you know, on a 160 watt panel. Now, again, the sun is just going through the clouds, but I mean, 123 watts. So we're going to take a look at that in a moment again. All right, so we did move this and we have, let's just show you the shadow real quick so you could see it. So you see that shadow? Um, now, if I slightly angle this panel, you can see that it, it pretty much goes almost dead center, a little on the low side. All right, but let's go ahead and check the wattage because now you could see that. Let's check the wattage and see what we're getting with this much better angle. 128 watts, 129 on a 160 watt panel. Why? That little adapter really helped us out. Now again, we've got clouds, it's gonna go up and down, but think about that. You're really maximizing the solar panels, just amazing. Now what an angle, that is something else. So let's go ahead and check out our 400 watt panel. Let's also check out how we use that accessory with th thick panels, standard thick panels. 
All right, so we have a really good angle. We're getting like 275 watts on our Delta Pro that we have connected. Let's go ahead and show you the uh, device here. So this is the perfect angle, guys. And how do I know that? Well, let me show you. I mean, I'm going to try to zoom in, but this dot, this shadow is almost exactly where it needs to be. I hope you can see that. Let me try to zoom in more. But that shadow is almost dead center. And this is a perfect angle right now based off where the sun is. So, you know, 400 watt panels. You know, we, we have a cloudy sky, to be honest with you. If you look up here, this is a cloudy sky we're dealing with. And, uh, you know, getting 275 watts. Well, you know what? That just tells us that this accessory here is worth the 20 bucks. So I said to myself, how can I get this to work for a regular solar panel? You know, these stiff solar panels that are out there. And again, just an idea. Will it work? I'm not sure. But I'm going to take a hanger. And I am going to actually pull it through here and hang it over the panel. All right, so you just want to take a hanger. If you still have a metal hanger, you just kind of open it up. All right? And uh, I'll set it up and I'll show you what I'm doing. So... So there's my invention, your hanger. And I lowered this, right? Because if I would have raised it, it would have said, okay, here's the center. So, you know, I kind of put it as low as I could possibly be, telling me that the angle right here is the best it can be. So guys, check that out. We are getting 86 watts out of a 100 watt panel by using this device. Now, let me show you what the perfect angle looks like. So that's the perfect angle right now based off where the sun is at. Now this does need to be removed after you get your perfect angle you remove this but let me go ahead and show you. The dot is exactly in the dead center. You see that? The dot is dead center. And once you get that, you just take this off. Just take this off. Don't leave it on because it's going to create a shadow. And that will then give you the optimum, you know, angle to give you the most wattage. So, not bad, huh? A little hanger, you know? You can use this with regular panels. So, guys, I'm really glad that I pulled this out and played with it enough to actually find a way to use it on regular panels as well. Um, I hope you found this video helpful. Listen, if you did, definitely give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate that. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, become a member of the family, and let us know, post a note. Let us know that you have subscribed and you are now an extension of our family. Lastly, share our video. You know, maybe this video will help someone that you know or in a group chat room. Thanks so much. Have a great day. Hey guys, take a moment and give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. As you can see, Brooklyn, she's waving her tail for you. Take a moment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell and you'll get notified of new videos we come out with. Also, follow us and contact us on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. We'd love to have you. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.